My name is Chris Palmer and in today's advanced SEO tips video, now when we're talking about traffic and advanced SEO tactics, we need to start getting very granular. What I mean by this is if we're running campaigns, especially traffic or CTR campaigns, we need to start breaking down the metrics. So if we're looking at on page and off page, on page, we need to match all of the metrics. The same is exact for off page, meaning the links, where are they coming from? At what velocity? Now we need to start looking at traffic and user signals the same way. So let's go ahead and hop into the computer quick here. Let me show you exactly what I mean. First and foremost, we're going to need a seed set or a seed keyword. That seed keyword, is going to be build backlinks. You see, I actually have a training on building backlinks, so that's why it's in my mind. But if we're looking up build backlinks, we need to first analyze the SERP, right? Competitive analysis. So if we're looking at the SERP here and we scroll down, we can see that the top performer for this particular keyword is Neil Patel. So if we go to his site, we're gonna hop over here, we're gonna see exactly what he's doing in his site not only the on page, not only the off page, but his user signals, his traffic signals. This is the blueprint to ranking. So let me go ahead in here and let's dissect this. Now you can use a plethora of tools to literally dissect the traffic, but one of the best is going to be SEMrush. So if we take his tool, they actually have something here. It's called traffic analytics. You can use whatever you want. But if I go to traffic analytics and I type this in here, right? Here's the link. Let's go in and take a look. And this is going to tell us some of the key things. Because if we're looking at traffic, we want to know how much traffic, from where, and how, and how often is it coming in, and for what keywords. So let's start breaking this down. So if we take a look, one of the first questions that I get is, well, Chris, what about proxy? Should I only send my country? Where should I be sending the traffic from? Well, if this is your competitor, right, and we're looking here, we can see that, hey, we don't only need to buy residential proxies or mobile proxies from the United States. We can also use Brazil, India, United Kingdom, and Canada. So let's come over here. So number one is where does traffic come from, right? What country? So that's going to be the first thing. Now, this is going to determine the proxies. Where are we going to start sending it from? The next step is referring domains. Now, I've often talked about authority domains or authority traffic starting and ending at particular domains, right? But a better way to analyze this is by simply looking at the competition that is currently beating you. Where is their traffic to that page coming from? This is more important. So let's take a look here. We can see that his authority traffic is coming primarily from, if we look over here, but more so over here, Facebook, he has his project.org, YouTube, PayPal. But if we go in here, right, you can view the full report and really take a look and, and really dissect exactly where all the traffic is and at what levels. So that's the next step is where does the traffic start from? All right, now you wanna be able to start and end with authority traffic, but mimic it off of your competitor. Now let's talk about the last step when we're talking about traffic. This is a key element. So let's pop back over here to SEMrush. I wanna go ahead and showcase something for you. So if we come inside of here, all right, we'll go to the domain overview, my mistake. Let's go to the organic research. We're going to come in here. We're going to go to the exact URL. And what we're going to do is we're going to paste the actual domain that we want to compete with. Because again, remember, we want to target build backlinks. So let's throw him in here and let's take a look. This exact page is ranking for these keywords. So keep this in mind when we're talking about traffic. So this number three is keyword traffic and how much, meaning what keywords is this page ranking for? Because if I'm sending in traffic, I want to be able to match and mimic, just like on page and off page. I want to mimic the traffic. So here's the keywords that he's building this traffic from. So this is how I'm going to start sending in the traffic. This is how my page is going to be found. Now, aside from that, this is something that people always skip over and it's going to be the last step, especially when we're talking about traffic, especially for you guys in local markets or affiliate. One of the key things that people miss out on is, okay, we figured out 
We figured out the proxies. We figured out how much traffic in the keywords. But if you're getting keyword traffic, one step that people always miss is branded traffic. People are sending the keywords, the variations, and every other type of traffic from the right domains using the right proxies. But if you're getting keyword traffic, right? For this instance, it's build backlinks. If I'm getting keyword traffic, then I should also be getting branded traffic. So if you're increasing your keyword traffic, make sure you're also increasing your brand traffic. And again, you can mimic this based off of your top ranking competitor. So this is going to wrap up today's advanced SEO tips. My name is Chris Palmer. If you have any further questions related to SEO, advanced SEO, on-page SEO, off-page SEO, really anything at all, always feel free to go ahead and leave it in the comments below. And I most certainly look forward to seeing you in the next advanced SEO tips video. Have a wonderful day.